Hey everybody, John here with another FinCast. I'm at the Global Expo uh, 2016. I'm here with Daniel Griffin from CCAM, who is going to tell us how to get rid of algae in our aquarium, which was probably the biggest, when I owned the local store, the local reef store, that was one of the biggest questions we got, how to get rid of algae. But today we're talking about planted aquariums on the freshwater exactly. side. So Daniel, if you have what people sort of recognize as those spots all over your leaves, green spot algae, how do you approach that, how do you get rid of it? So green spot algae is usually going to grow when you have low phosphates. It's sort of counterintuitive. People think, you know, our nutrients, if they're too high, that's when we get algae. But green spot's going to thrive in that condition, actually. So what you're going to want to do if, you're, if you are getting that is actually dosing phosphates. You know, you're not getting enough just from the food, just from the fish. And actually bringing those phosphates back up so that the plants can use them, um, use the nitrates and phosphates, will actually help you get rid of that algae and control it. Um, so, because my whole thought process has always been, oh, I have phosphates in my tank, I have to get rid of the phosphates, it's causing the algae. You're saying add phosphates. Well, in this case, that can help you. So, we always think of phosphates, especially if you come from a reef background. You want your nitrates really low, you want your phosphates really low, you want those, you know, kept under control and as low as possible. But in a planted tank, the plants need those nitrates, need those phosphates. So, they are using that. So, from your from your fish waste, from your leftover fish food, you know, they're using those nitrates, they're using those phosphates, but they're using them in a set ratio. So if your, you know, plants are going to use nitrates and phosphates in about a 10 to 1 ratio, about one part phosphate for every 10 parts um, nitrates. Um, and if, if they get out of whack, then they can't use them. So if you've got 10 parts nitrates, one part phosphate, the plants can use those. If you've got zero phosphates, they can't use any of those nitrates. So they are going to keep going up and up. And then the algae uses the nitrates. And then the algae, yeah. So then the algae can use the nitrates and it can thrive. So green spot algae thrives in low phosphate conditions, higher nitrate conditions. So even, you know, as those phosphates get to zero, that green spot, al spot algae starts growing. You add a little in there, you bring those phosphates back up, make that available to the plants. The plants can suddenly outcompete it that, that green spot algae is going to go away. You know, it may take a week or two before you really see it start to disappear, um, but it'll usually stop pretty quickly as you start dosing that. Um, of course, you know, if your nitrates are very, very high or you know, out of whack, you're going to want to do a water change, bring them back into a manageable range before you start just dosing. Uh, but what you will start to see is as those phosphates go up a little, your nitrates are going to start coming down because plants are able to use them again. And they're going to use them at a much faster rate than the algae would. So Daniel, thank you so much. I, I really appreciate the advice. I, I'm calling Daniel my uh, shrimp coach, my planted tank shrimp coach, because he's really helped me out. I started getting some spots on my leaves, sent him some emails, uh, and I'll put this in the blog, but you know, he, he figured out right away what was wrong. Uh, and, and as soon as we started dosing the phosphate, I had no more of that green spot algae. So I, so I do appreciate it. Thank you very much. Thanks for watching this FinCast. Of course, there's another one around the corner. There always is a new FinCast every Sunday on reef tanks, planted tanks, shrimp, you name it. Click around. I'm sure you'll find something that you'll like. My name's John, and I'll see you in the next FinCast.